This, this, isn't this a beautiful painting? I, I, one, one of the things that I, I love to do for you is to bring uh, art, you know, so that to expand your, your uh, visuals. But uh, it's a beautiful painting of, uh, of course, uh, the amazing grace that's, as we said at Wednesday, that saved a wretch like me, right? But I, I'm just gonna, I brought this up here because don't forget, um, he saw our need right? God saw us in our sin. He saw our need. And He spoke into our need with exactly what we needed. He saw us as human beings that were, by the way, disobedient and rebellious and sinful. And, and, and you need to understand something. God abhors evil. The Bible is very clear about that. Abhorrent to Him in our sin. And yet, instead of pushing away from us, by all rights he could have, what's the first thing he did? You know, the Garden of, of Eden. It's the first thing he did. He went there and said, I'm going to fix it. <laughs> That's the Joe Meyer version, as I've often said it. I'm going to fix it. Uh, Genesis 3.15 says he's going to send his son. So he saw us in our need. He saw us as people, as flesh and blood. And he saw our need, and he spoke into our need with eternal redemption, you see. And, and you say, yeah, but Joe, that's Jesus. That's not me. Well, let me just prove to you that it is you too, by the way. Jesus said this, not even the Son of Man came to be served, but to serve and to give his life as a ransom for many. Why did he say that? Because what he was saying about Christianity is this, is it's all about serving. Christianity is what I'm talking about tonight. Seeing people as humans not just someone to walk past. Seeing people as humans, seeing their need and speaking into that need. And obviously you guys know, especially if they don't know Jesus Christ, don't know Jesus as their Lord and Savior.